Kim and I met April 1st, 2019 at the Wooden Spoon in White Rock. Uh, it was April Fool's Day. And I think he was nervous because I, he thought I was an April Fool's prank, but thankfully I showed up. If I told you that I've fallen A heart-shaped arrow through my chest And that date was very memorable, especially for a first date because he picked me up with a car that was on its last legs of life. I remember the key broke off when he tried to start it. The window won't roll open and the window handle broke off. The car could barely go uphill, but we made it. awkward first date and uh, wasn't sure if there was going to be a second one but uh, here we are getting married again and um, yeah that's that's kind of how our first date went March 27th, 2019. It was actually my grandma's birthday. We met through an app called Hinge. And I messaged him first because he, he had a prompt about making eggs benedict. So I asked if it comes with mimosas. I state your name. I, Sean Dale. Take you. Take you. Your wife's name. Kimberly Lim. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. My constant friend. My constant friend. And my love from this day forward. And my love from this day forward. You may put on the ring now. Wow, so pretty. I, Kimberly Lim. Take you. Take you. State your groom's name. Sean Christopher Dale. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. My constant friend. My constant friend. And my love from this day forward. And my love from this day forward. These rings are a symbol of your commitment, a reminder of your love, and a promise forever. It's like a circle with no end. Take my hand. Lots of memorable moments to pick from. Just off the top of my head, uh, one really memorable night was uh, we went on a date to the Richmond Night Market. This is when both Kim and I were a little bit thinner. <laughs> so I thought if me and this guy will get married, we'll make it through any <laughs> trials and tribulations given what our first date was. in my hometown, my birthplace, which makes it extra, extra special. And I love that your family was gracious enough to fly all the way here to witness 
our, I guess, sort of mini Bowery wall and get to witness my place of birth and my home country, which is really cool. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you and go to more adventures together. And I love you.